that's pretty cool. And zoom film. They put up fresh paint. Kinda hard to miss this airport with this gigantic, let's see, 6, 12, 18 foot wide, widescreen television. Kinda hard to miss it. Why is Anthony Pacente still Oneida County's executive? Why? Mohawk Valley Community College, airframe and power plant technology. Of which there are no jobs for that in this area. You gotta move basically out of state. <laughs> or to JFK Airport. There's the C-130. Strategic Aviation Company, that's what they work on, is the uh, C-130s. Supposedly, I don't know, I've never seen that many C-130s here. Then, Rome Labs over there. Next to that is Strategic Aviation. Here you have Booz Allen and Hamilton, New York State Tech. It's a uh, it's a uh, consulting company, I do believe. I don't know. I've never had to go in there, so Google them. Booz Allen Hamilton. I just like the lights on the building. Kind of like a Halloween color lights. Orange, blue. Like I said, they need more red, white, and blue. Over here you have Innovare, which is uh, basically an education service. I don't really understand it. Uh, it's a nationwide uh, type company. School districts pay them. I don't know. I think it's hot. And all that right there that you're looking at now is Chris Tech at nighttime. Very interesting company. They do all kinds of specialized uh, wiring. Check out their website, Chris Tech. K R I S T E C H. The airport, millionaire. Ooh, check out the moon.
the little orange dot way out there, that is the moon. Nice. And it's orange. And it's a little early for it to be orange, which tells me that thunderstorms are going to be here for tomorrow, which is almost today. The air traffic control tower is unmanned. I forgot where they handled the flight operations from. Maybe Syracuse. But yeah, there's nobody in the top of the air traffic control tower. When they add a new control tower with federal money, obviously. I hope they tear that one down and just make a smaller one because, well, it's, there just isn't that much aviation activity around here for an air traffic control tower. In this area here, I believe, is where the medical choppers are. Always wanted to be a chopper pilot. Chris Top, wire and receiving. And you can't see it, but there is a lot of wire over there. I'm not too sure what this trucking parking lot is for. It's all trailers. But I think it's related to uh, the olive oil company here on Griffiths. Uh, just about see the moon above the hangar. Pretty cool. Continuing on. This is the Operation Security and Maintenance Building, an Office of Pistol Licensing. Hey. That's where the... Can't really see it at night, but I thought I'd do a nighttime video since I like being on Griffiths at night. No people. <laughs> Turn. Why that tractor trailer is flipped over like that, I don't know, a tornado maybe? <laughs> Interesting. Man, I really need new brakes. Among a lot of other shit. <laughs> need a lot. <laughs> Alrighty. And this big building right here that you're now looking at is the newest addition to Christek Corporation. It's basically their supply warehouse. Uh, their distribution building. People order from Chris Tuck and this place puts it all on the truck and delivers it. And I thought it was going to be a small building.
but it's actually a very big building. And this is a Collins Aerospace, which I'm not too sure on this, so don't be mad at me, but I believe it was once known as Bendix Aerospace or Bendix Corporation, I believe. And Collins is a very big building. Hmm. Weird. Their cafeteria lights are off. Usually the cafeteria lights are on all night. Pretty cool. Again, that's New York State Tech. You drive straight ahead, you get to the airport. Chris Tech right there, and the Chris Tech uh, Distribution Center. Then you got Rome Labs right here. I would go past the gate and check it out, but I'd probably get shot. <laughs> so I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> My name. Wait for the truck. Waiting for the truck. <clears throat> oh, he turned. Maybe they got, no, they got workers. Usually Chris Tech has three shifts. That's a big building. And all that's Rome Labs, as well as the Defense Finance and Accounting Service. I know a girl that became an accountant. Yeah. She makes damn good money right now, too. I mean, damn good money. How good? Well, she's... Let's see, she'd be uh, 28 right now. She's probably earning close to the six-figure range. She makes more in a year than I make in a lifetime. By the way, what is the speed limits on these roads? It's 30 miles an hour, right? Huh. Maybe you should tell them that. This is the MGS company. It's a manufacturer. Not too sure of what, so you'd have to check it out. This used to be a, a bus company. I believe it was at one time Orion Bus and then it became Bernie Bus and now I'm not sure what it is. Train facility right here. They work on trains. At least they used to. Not too sure what they do now. Maintenance down. We're going up. Going up top. Rock. Security around here doesn't do much about the asshole drivers. <laughs> Which begs to ask, what do they do?
Well, tonight they're gonna get smoked out. <laughs> A fourth A&M. Griffiths does not need an F4. Griffiths has never had F4 Phantoms. If you need an F106 Delta Dart on that, there is one 